In this tutorial, we'll look at how to add a hover effect to your Bootstrap 5 card component. All right, so I have a simple example here in this project. I have these cards. I just copied these cards from the, from the uh, example and the documentation and modified them a little bit. So let's say when we hover these cards, we want to get like a hover effect, like a zoom effect. So I'm going to go to my CSS. I'm going to write some custom CSS. These cards have a class of dot of card, right? So just class card and what we can do is we can target this in the hover state so we can say in the hover state it should be a little bit bigger so we have to transform property in css and with this you can rotate elements you can move elements and you can also scale elements bigger or smaller so let's say we want to scale it 15 percent bigger right one is the normal and then 1.15 is 15 percent bigger when you do that and now hover them, they indeed become 15% bigger, but it's not very smooth, right? So we want to make it a so-called transition. So you need to select the cards in the normal state and you can use the transition property and you can say any uh, property, right? So all properties that get changed or just a transform property, but usually people use all. Every property that gets changed, that change should happen in 0 0.3 seconds, right? So when you do this, it's, it's a very smooth um, uh, transition. Right? You can play around with 0 0.2 seconds or whatever. But you can see now this is a nice smooth uh, transition. Right, So it's really important that you have mastered the underlying fundamentals when you work with Bootstrap or the front end in general. Those underlying fundamentals are CSS and also JavaScript. So make sure you have um, advanced at those skills. I have courses on them on both CSS and JavaScript. Check out the links in the description if you want to take those skills to an advanced professional level. By the way, if this was helpful, I'd really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. Also, check out my courses on CSS and JavaScript if you want to take those skills to an advanced level. Because in there, we will build some beautiful real-world projects from scratch so you can see how everything fits together and really master CSS or JavaScript. And I will also release other courses soon like React and Node.js. So if you want to be notified, then make sure you are subscribed to the email newsletter. You can find the link in the description. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon.